I want you to take a look at the aftermath of this fire right here. You can see this house is destroyed inside at the time of the fire. Five people all able to make it outside. Firefighters crediting two quick thinking neighbors for saving their lives. I can't even believe this happened. I, uh, geez, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's a morning Alex Ditko and Sean Kelly won't soon forget. It was so hot. It was incredible. And I mean, I'm talking from up the block. You could tell that it was uncontrolled. Ditko and Kelly are being hailed as heroes for saving five people from this burning home along Alancha Avenue. The pair spotted the blaze just after three and sprinted up the street knowing people were inside. My blood pressure is going through the roof. I just, we were so, we just wanted to get everyone out of the house. I mean, what happened to them was terrible. That the, the house is a tragedy. Ditko and Kelly said by the time they ran from the back porch to the front door, the house was engulfed. Take a look at this video given to us by firefighters. The fire intense, shooting out of every window and door. The pair pounding on the door, getting everyone outside. The older woman came out. It's like she, it's like she tried to process it. And like it was, it was terrible, and she just was having a breakdown. But finally, the rest of the family was able to get out of the house. They were choked up. They they couldn't breathe by the time they were coming out of the house. So I mean, they were head to toe black, covered in sweat. It was it was, was brutal. It like all five were taken to the hospital for smoke inhalation. Firefighters say if it wasn't for these two men and their bravery, this outcome could have been a lot worse. You have to credit those two young gentlemen. Uh, there's a lot going through your mind at that particular time. Firefighters say they want to tear the house down quickly out of safety concerns. The fire marshal's office is investigating the cause. Reporting in Brentwood, Caitlin Sykes, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Thanks.